Hi everybody, it's Nalzi here. We're going to load our game and play some Knights of Pen and Paper. Hope you're all doing sweet. I know I am. Um, where do we leave off? Oh god, we're we killing enchanted armor. Oh, super. What fun. Uh, now, I know I said I was feeling good, but I'm really not feeling that great. I've just come in over a cold, really. I've been talking about that in the last video. <clears throat> but today, something really strange has actually happened. I seem to have gained the power... Uh, of telekinesis? No, no, no. Could you imagine, though? No, honestly, something quite strange has happened. I um, can't hear properly. Um, all sounds are kind of... Uh, how should I describe it? Everything's out of tune. It's kind of strange, isn't it? Um, yeah, so I figured this game actually sounds okay, which is quite nice. Quite nice. Uh, it's probably just something to do with the fact I've got a cold, you know? And the liquids in my head have probably just, like, gotten all confused and stuff. Let's harmonic movement in the warrior. But yeah, so I'm not feeling super dupes today. Again, still feeling pretty banjo kazooied. <coughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, everything sounds really odd. <clears throat> it's really hard to kind of explain. Like, music, I was listening to I Would Do Anything For Love earlier, and Jesus, it sounds like a different song. Uh, I should have really hibernated that guy. And, um... Gosh, I was talking to Kim on Vint, and she sounded really weird. It's, it's the higher voices that are the worst, actually. Rhythian sounded okay, but Kim sounded very bizarre. And it's kind of just like a high twang. Like, everyone's taking a shot of helium. It's kind of odd. Uh, I spoke to the... I'm, I'm, I've called the doctor. They're going to get back to me. It's probably nothing. But um, that's what I've been up to today. Uh, not much, really. Kind of boring. I'm going to... God, I've lost... God, I've lost my credit card as well. <laughs> Oh, where is it? I don't know. I don't know. I've lost my credit card. I was gonna go. I was gonna say I want to go to the store and buy like some, some coffee, like a coffee drink or something. But I can't go to the store without my credit card. Oh no! Like, oh my God, they're hard. Those flipping warriors. Right, I'm gonna have a snooze actually if I can. Yeah, those warriors are pretty beefy. <clears throat> uh, so yeah, apologies. Nice pen of paper hasn't been on in a couple of days. I figured I'd. Give it a shotty. Uh, get the main story progressed. Right, two more of these assholes. We're going to sleep if we can, yeah. Hibernate. <clears throat> Should have done that in the first instance. Apologies that we didn't. So, yeah. <laughs> there we go, there we go. I'm super happy that you guys really enjoyed um, Game Dev Tycoon. I very much enjoy it, and so I'm going to play more of that. Yeah, I'm certainly going to play more of that. Because um, I had great fun with it, making up games and stuff. I'm not the most creative of people um, in terms of, like, ideas for names and stuff. Sips is some of the Sips' names. Are good. Call of Duty. I mean, can I ever get better than that? But, you know, I'll try my best. But a, a lot of the time I might just steal you guys' ideas in the comments. So, hee hee hee. Let's just get that guy down. Right. Uh, let's harmonic movement. Nobody doesn't need it. Distance, I guess. Oh, why did oh, what the fuck? Why did I just click on that with the with the with my mage? Still a bit lurgy. Still feeling a bit like poop, poop sticks. My taste is back. <laughs> For some reason, whenever I get a cold, I lose the ability to taste. It's really annoying. Like some people sometimes get it, but like I get it like every time. But it comes back, and I've got my taste back, which is nice. Uh, some people don't get their taste back. Do you ever know? Do you ever hear about that? It's kind of strange. Um, it's called, uh, it's not taste really, it's smell. It's called a Nosmia. Uh, right. <clears throat> We've closed the portal. Thank fuck for that. Level up here. What should we take? Harmony, Octavarium, Bard Sings, Heals, 3 HP for every group member for 2 turns. No. Power Cord, Dissonance. Let's put Dissonance up to try and get more magic damage out of this guy. Alright, what's the quest? What? The castle's overwhelmed by my minions. You must defeat them before they defeat you. There are so many monsters that you must kill through me. What? But we just did that, didn't we? How? how what? How? What? I'm so confused. We did... Um, <laughs> am, I, am I dreaming? Am I, like, asleep in my bed? Having a fever dream or something? Or did we not just fight seven of these assholes? We fought four in this video and then fucking three in the last. What is this bullshit? And this is the main story quest, I'm pretty sure, as well. So I'm not just, like, bullshitting around here. The fuck, man? 
Leader strike. Come on now. These guys are so beefy. <laughs> They're so annoyingly difficult to kill. Oh god, they've got Meteor. Oh. Flip. I'll tell you what I have been playing recently. Pokemon! The comment section if you've been playing Pokemon. My heart goes out to those who can't play Pokemon who don't have a 3DS or something. I'm sorry that you don't have one. You should, um, I don't know, let's try and save up for one if you can because it's definitely worth it. It's a great... Uh, what am I doing here? It's a great game. I am doing a themed run in my Pokemon. I am doing a run where I don't pick up anything but first gen Pokemon. It's really difficult. I call it an Orcist run, like Professor Oak. Um, but it's, it's really annoying um, because it's kind of difficult. Like there was one gym where every person was rock, like it was a rock gym, you know, and I had no water Pokemon. My my first choice of Pokemon was a Fennekin, but then I boxed that as soon as I could. And then my actual first gen starter was a Charizard. Well, Charmander, because Charmander's the fucking boss, right? But really, I really should have waited for something like a Squirtle, because, you know. Uh, and I, yeah, I got, I got slightly fucked by that. So I got a Vaporeon, and that all went well. It was quite cool. Um, my guys, what are they called? Because naming them is my favourite part of the game, really. Um, my So I've got a Pidgeot. If you don't like Pokemon, I'm sorry. It's going to be pretty boring for you. I've got a Pidgeot, and his name is Doombird. My Charizard is called Blaze Lizard. My Alakazam is called Wizard Brain. My Pikachu is called Zap Rat. My Doug, no wait a minute. My Doug Trio is called Nightmare Guy. My let's strike this guy. My Duduo is called Bitey Beak. My Snorlax is called Sleepy Bear. And I'm running out of things now. My Slowpoke is called Clay Dope. Uh, which is a cute name, I think. Um, what other things did I get? Uh, didn't I catch... Um, my Vulpix. Oh, what did I call it? I only got that recently. Hannah gave me a Vulpix egg. What did I call it? Uh, oh, um, Fire Fluff. I think I called it Fire Fluff. Right, are we done? To have a snooze. Jesus Christ. My Vaporeon is called Terror Fish. One R in Terror. That's part of the Terror. The typo is part of the Terror. Uh, let's level up here. Guys, blessing. I think we could put that up actually. Get into that stage now. Oh, how is there more coming? No. Three missing numbers. No. Two. One. Okay, these actually may not be so difficult. These are actually Pokemon themselves, which is funny. Uh, oddly appropriate. Um, okay, well, I, I, have I done all my Pokemon? Have I got the game open? Hold on, I think I've got the game open here. Right next to me. Oh yeah, I do. Uh, what else have I got? Where's my Pokemon? Pokemon. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, that's all of them. I can't see my box, though, where I've got all my extras. I can't remember. I think I've got, I've got definitely got more, obviously. It's just really difficult. That's extra challenge. Me, like, obviously, my favourite Pokemon are the first gen Pokemon. Uh, I only really got into first gen, and after that I got a bit old for it, and I didn't really get into the other gens. But there's some really cool Pokemon, like, there's that, like, little cat one that's really cute. Um, anyway! Sorry, Pokemon that hour is over. Killing fucking random mobs for no flipping reason is now... I hit that guy with the ice thing so that um, he gets stunned for a couple of turns. You can't see it, but he should be stunned. Yeah, come on. This better be the last pack of mobs, I swear to fuck. We might have to fight Iron Maidens after this, actually, because I know that they're in here as well, aren't they? Steep freeze them, get a few stuns on the go. Uh, yeah, just hit him. Strike. I feel, I hope, in fact, those of you who have played this game, 
am I nearing the end of it? I use a website that's called howlongtobeat.com, which is a great website. And what it does is it basically, if, you, if you're going to play a game, it tells you how long it takes to finish it. Now, you guys may be like, oh, but that's spoilers now. Like, eh, not for me. I am a bit of a completionist. I like achievements. I like completing things. I'm a bit of a... Not, uh, you could liken it to being a little OCD about completing things, but I'm, I'm really not. That's just silly. OCD is thrown around too much. Uh, I just like... I feel better when things are finished, you know? And uh, I like to look up games before I start playing them and just see, okay, if I play this game, how long is it going to take to finish? I do that for pretty much all games I play, just to kind of get in my head, you know, this is how long I'm going to be dedicating to this game. Fantastic, you know? But... Knights of Pen and Paper isn't on that website, which is really odd. Um, one of the only games that aren't on the website. Even game old games like Abe's Odyssey and shit are on there, so like I don't understand why uh, it wouldn't be there, but it's not. So I don't know how long this actually takes to finish. Um, but you guys hopefully can tell me in the comment section, am I nearing the end? You know, I feel like I ought to be. I'm on day 520, for fuck's sake. You know, my characters are quite high level. They're not highest level levels, but they're quite high level. I feel like we've got through quite a lot. Your skin is now rock and raises your HP by 10 for 3 times. No, I don't like that because it's a, a taunt. A powerful scream raises your straight level by 2 HP return, regen per turn. Let's get that just for the HP regen, I suppose. Right, let's finish the quest. Ah! The game dev gang are here. Ugh, they're too strong. Only you can do this. Evil laugh. Oh, come on. Please help us. We were trying to be heroes, but we just messed up. Fuck, we do need to kill Iron Maidens. Wait, 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 wait. What was the name of this quest, actually? Minions Everywhere, part three. Ah, right, so we are actually getting through this. These are fucking elites! Oh, my God. They're level 30 elites. Okay, two. Two, then. We're not doing three at a time. Fucking hell. Right, let's get this done. Leader Strike. I fucking can't believe we're doing this. Look at how much health they have. Oh my god. This is just going to be the grind episode where it's just like we fucking grind mobs. Minions everywhere. Come on. Sleep immune! Mmm. Bad news. Bad news. That looks like they're opening their chests and showing us like bullets and shit inside there. What the hell are they doing? Harmonic movement. Let's harmonic movement up the grandma so we don't lose her. Uh, are they stun immune? Yep, they are. Okay. Fine, we don't fucking need that shit. We'll just rip you to shreds, Iron Maidens. What are they doing? They're opening the shit. They look like a bit like Daleks, actually, from inside. Let's holy shield our paladin so we don't lose him. Right, we've nearly got one down. This is going to take a long time. Let's use our heal bot to get those guys up. Right, since they're immune to everything else, let's just use our highest spell, which is fireball. And um, get everything down. Ouch, ouch. They're actually not hitting for that much. Paladin seems to be okay. I'm getting heals from my uh, bard. Quite like having the bard. He doesn't do any damage, but what he does do. Do we need mana? Nah, not yet. Sorry about that silence there. Just cutting out a um, cough because I'm still, I'm still sick. <laughs> what was me? I'm going to find that fucking credit card. I'm going to go to the store. Where the hell could it be? I don't know where I've left it. See, when I come home from work, I just like throw everything on the ground. You know, I'm one of these grim throwers. I'm just like, fuck everything, kadoosh. And you know, throw it all on the fucking floor. So what that happens then is my wallet like opens and my money goes everywhere on the ground. And I end up having to pick up money and cards and shit all the time. Uh, yeah, I shouldn't do that. But I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. The satisfaction of doing it is just it's worth it. Well, thank God we didn't put three of these things in here anyway. Right, now we're out of mana on a couple of the dudes, so... Let's just hit him. Hit for six. Flippin' hell. Okay, guy's blessing. Ooh, it does actually hit for quite a lot. The holy shield was really helping. Let's harmonically move our paladin back up. So we don't have to waste a shield on him. And it should die now. There we go. And we need to do one more. Brilliant. Brilliant. Oh, Grandma's leveled up. Put it into a deep freeze, yeah? I think so. No, wait. Stream. Yeah, stream. Put that up. Right, sleep. Yes, we got away with it. 
fight the last Iron Maiden, and then hopefully we'll finish this god-awful quest. Please, God. I like it when the bars are bigger. It doesn't seem like they've got as much health. But actually, they have just as much. Right, we've got all our dots on. We've got the, uh, the rip, the wait, the bleed, the strike stun, I think, and the fire burn. I don't know what that is. I think pretty sure it's the strike thing. Like an incapacitate or something. Do, 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 do. I tell you what I did do uh, the a uh, couple of days ago. I finished watching um, Deep Space Nine, Star Trek Deep Space Nine. Holy fuck, my god! I've been meaning to talk about this for days. I swear to God, Deep Space Nine. I went into it. So if you're not a Trek fan, this is going to mean nothing to you. But try and listen because it me if you like television and stuff, then you'll be interested. But Star Trek, I was a big Next Generation fan. Fucking hell, John Luke Picard to me was the epitome of the Star Trek captains. But, going into Deep Space Nine, I was like, oh, this is boring, this is it's just a space station. It's about a space station rather than being a ship that explodes the galaxy. It's about uh, a static uh, space station defending uh, a wormhole and a planet called uh, Bajor. And it was kind of boring at the start, and I was like, no, this is rubbish. But my god, is it good. Like, to me, the captain of that spaceship, the commander, was uh, Benjamin Siskel. To me, perhaps is now my favourite Star Trek captain of all time. Like, he is a fantastic captain. Like, I can't believe the character arc that he had to go through and just how fantastic the story was put together. And, oh my god, I could fucking write stories about how good that show is. It's really good. And now that it's finished, I'm moving on to uh, Voyager. Uh, I'm watching them all in order. I haven't actually watched any Voyager. Woot, we made it. Ah, here we go. You did it. I will be eternally grateful for what you did. Now I have to clean up this mess. Hurry to the next temple. You have so much to do. Thanks again, my friends. You're the heroes of our realm. Game Dev again. The castle is now cleansed. You're amazing. Good job, right? Well, good. Is there anything in the castle for us? Like a reward? That's not just fucking XP. <laughs> um, devotion, more HP, and some threats. Uh, leader Strike and Holy Shield. Let's take um, more Devotion. Give us some more HP and some extra threat going forward. Right, we need to travel to the Mountain Temple. That's for level 29s, though. I'm not level 29. What? Escort villager? Why is there a level 3 villager here? A villager comes closer and asks, Could you please escort me back home? I miss my family. Sure, let's do this nice and easy. Yeah, okay. Why the fuck is a villager in this castle in the first place? What an asshole. What a waste of my goddamn life, villager. I'm going to get attacked. Ah! Oh! This is annoying. Oh my god! What the fuck are these things? Yeti strikes! There's lots of shit here though, that's cool. Oh my god. Harmonic movement. I need to keep my paladin up. Right, hibernate one of them. That guy at the back. Fucking hell, that's a lot of shit. Oh wait, 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 let's deep freeze one of them as well, that one. How is deep freeze super effective against yetis? That's bullshit. These yetis have a lot of health. Holy fuck. My power cord. Right, okay, now here we go. Leader strike. I thought, like, a level 3 quest, not going to be a problem. You know, just get the guy and run. But apparently we're going to have to fight. It better not be fighting every stage of the way. That's going to really piss me off. Can I get that instead of fighting? No. You know, poke him with your stick for 30. Okay, he's still sleeping away, having a snooze, having a little nap. But, oh my god, yeah, Benjamin Sisko, holy shit, amazing. I love that guy so much, he's amazing. Um, so if you're thinking about it, if you're if you're a big Star Trek Next Generation fan, and you're like, no, 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 Nalzi, nothing can change my mind, you know, fucking Picard's the best, or Kirk's the best, you, you need you need to watch next generation. Uh, you need to watch Deep Space Nine. It's a little shit at the start, okay? Uh, the start of every sci- I mean, fucking hell. Next Generation sucked the first season. Before Riker got the beard, it sucked, okay? We all know that, for a fucking fact. And in all honesty, it, um, Deep Space Nine is actually kind of the same, because the show kind of sucks until Cisco gets his beard, and that's around season two. So watch it if you like Star Trek. Uh, if you've missed it out because you're like, oh, it's boring... I'm not going to enjoy that. Oh, got some achievement tick there. Get some of these grindstones before we leave. Yeah, yeah, come on. Yes, yes. 
And this one, please. Sweet, all the grain stones. Right, do we need to sleep? Or can we just move on? Are we going to get attacked? Are we going to get attacked on every fucking place we move to? Because that's like f one, two, three, four fights. Are we going to get attacked again? Ah! Annoying. By a tree. Thankfully, they're going to get weaker and weaker as we go towards the village, so... Really, this and the next one are only going to be the next... They're only going to be ones that take us like longer than three seconds. Still annoying, though. You better get something good out of escorting this fucking villager, I'll tell you right now. You better be like, you've unlocked the super class of sex guy who's good at... I don't fucking know. I'm sick. I'm sick, guys. I'm sorry. My jokes are bad today. Sex guy. Yeah, okay. <laughs> uh, how weren't moving yourself? What the fuck? He's poisoned, I think. That's strange. I've never seen that fight before. Uh, pop. There we go. Yes, 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 yes. XP, yes, yes. Right, let's go. Let's continue. This way. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we're gonna get attacked again. What a fucking surprise. The way I know we're gonna get attacked is there's no, um, roll count on the side there. Now, these should die quickly, I think. I hope. Meteor. Gonna give us a Geist Blessing as well. Just get our mana back up. I don't really fancy sleeping. You know, we shouldn't need to with these weak ass mobs. Do 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 Meteor, yeah. Oh, oops, daisies. Cleave them. Let's do some AoE. Oh shit! The bleed damage is kind of powerful. Let's regenerate um, ourselves. Ooh. Yeah, that bleed damage. Let's just get rid of that one. Harmonic movement. Right, let's deep freeze that guy so she doesn't uh, give us another bleed effect somewhere. Strike. Yeah, it's dead. It's dead. It's dead. And leader strike. Okay. Right. We're on the way again. Lots of XP. Blah, blah, blah. Move to the village. I really want to get a class unlocked. Like, I'm quite interested in class unlocks. I don't know why. What is this? Guards? Why? Why are they attacking us? See, this is what happens, you fucking idiots. Go away. We're friends with the king and the guards. Why are they attacking us? I don't understand. Alright, we can give these to the, the guy, actually. While we're here. 11 grainstones. Oh my fucking god. What? Didn't uh, okay okay I guess can we level can we take anything Mr John uh, right we've done that we've done um, Ramon has got some sweet gear to be honest we should really upgrade the robes eh I don't know the armor we'll come back to that we'll come back to that we don't, we're not going to rush that right let's keep going finish this quest a long journey for a low level man. He's only level 3. This is a level 3 fucking encounter. I don't... Oh shit, hold on. Getting a phone call. I'm back. It was the doctor just calling to tell me that I'm not going to die. <laughs> so there you go. Oh, living with hypochondria. I killed the rats while I was on the phone, by the way. I got bored. Anyway, um, thanks a lot. My family so happy. Okay. Sniper amulet. Minus one threat. Is that it? Was that it? It was just... Uh, it was just XP. Fuck. Okay, then. Right, what have we got here? We can give him some dissonance. Yeah, I want to put that up, actually. Do I want to put that up? No, I don't. What do I want to put? I want to put, um... I want movement. I never used dissonance, really. Why, why did I level up before? Escort an elder. Collect carrots. Fuck off. That carrot quest. I want to do it, but it's just really annoying. Um... Right, let's have a sleep, actually. Let's have a nice snooze. There we go. Right! Now, we're, our quest for, oh, is up there. Uh, it's going to be hard, isn't it? It's going to be really annoying and difficult. 50 gold to go up there? Oh, come on. Well, thankfully, we're going to roll okay, I think. Yeah, that was the NHS 24. NHS 24 is this really amazing service in the UK where if you feel sick or if you feel ill, you can just call them up and it's 24-7. 
Uh, oh shit. And um, you you get to talk to uh, oh there's four grindstones here. Uh, actually, I don't really give a shit. Peep peep, I'm chicken. And they put you through to a nurse or a doctor. Twenty four, like literally twenty four. Oh, I can actually. Sweet. And yeah, they just called me. They were like, yeah, you're probably feeling like that there because of the cold, because of your cold symptoms that um, there's nothing to worry about. And they tell you what to do, like uh, if you should go and get some meds or if you go to, go and see a doctor. They're very good. It's honestly probably one of the best uh, things I think about living in the UK. Uh, I know it sounds strange and maybe a bit wow, you know, but that is true. Like it's fucking great service they, they provide there. So thumbs up to the NHS24. Am I going to get attacked again? The fuck is this? Oh, come on. I'm not... I, I know there's only one, but I'm not fucking wasting my time on him. Peep, peep, I'm a chicken. Peep, peep. Yep, peep, peeps. Peepity, peepity, peeps. Right. Quest. Travel to the Mountain Temple. Go to the Mountain Temple. You're late. The Black Mage must be there by now. On our way. Right, let's go. Where are we going? Oh, my... All the way over there! Are you kidding? A hundred and four fucking gold? All I'm saying is that better be re uh, reimbursed. A hundred and four gold is not, you know, a drop in the bucket. That is a lot of goddamn my money. But at least we're exploring, I guess. A hundred and four gold, though. That's a lot of fucking dough. Let's see what's going on over here. Mr. Krabs there on the left. Oh no! Oh come on! Oh, uh, um, crazy ogre man! Oh, fuck off! Peep peep! Oh no! No, they didn't peep the fucking peeps! No! No, I want to peep out of this! Peepity peeps! No! God damn you! Stop opening that as well! Peep de peep peep peep! Yeah! Peep peep! I'm a chicken. <laughs> Okay, let's go. What is that? What is that shine thing there? I think it's the breath of this thing. Um, right, where are we going here? We were nearly there as well. The high, quite high rolls required not to be attacked in this area. You know, it says 10? Holy fuck. Oh, no, this is the fucking Phoenix cave. This is where I was with the fucking phoenixes and shit. Uh, peep all the day. Peep all the days. Is that where we're actually going? Are we going to that goddamn Phoenix cave? Oh, no, no, we went past it. Wow, 10,000 XP just for traveling to a cave. Okay. We got a battle the Black Ninja. Holy shit. Okay, a level 32 Black Ninja. Tune in next time, everyone. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, you know what to do. And I'll catch you all next time. Have a great day. See you later. Bye. This is my outro song, so that the vid doesn't end too who suddenly. Be sure to click like and fave and drop a comment if you think that you want to. Oh, oh, and there's tons of other stuff for you to click in the in the background for you. So go out, go ahead and do that. Thanks for watching the vid, you beautiful people. That is all for now, be sure to subscribe and I'll catch you all later. Oh god. Bye. Seriously, why are you still watching this? Go and subscribe and drop a comment below. God damn you, stop watching video. Click fave, drop a comment, I think you want to, but if you don't, well that's your opinion, I guess.